I seen you in studio, Big Sean, Travis Scott. What is yeah. coming? Is this like some I Swear to God two type no, music? I got, I got, uh, I got, I got a new single for, uh, with Travis Scott. Uh huh. I got, a new, I got a new single drop with Travis Scott. You know my next single, my single right now, uh, hip hop speech on Lil Yachty. Yeah, I was going to show the dance in a couple seconds. Yeah, yeah it's yeah. not taking out. Yeah. Uh, but I got, uh, I got a new, I got like, I got plenty of shit with Travis Scott though. Mm -hmm. I got wow. some. Of them so y'all in the studio out in LA, French. right? Yeah. Y'all was living it out there. Y'all yeah, yeah. supposed to get it like nights in the. See, I know about you. I can tell. Really talk, they talk with you. Travis, my boy, man, he a good nigga. He like. Travis is crazy. He'll, he'll, he'll take me out the blue. This race, this this race, these fucking Lamborghinis, bro. I want to see if you can really drive. <laughs> and, and you trying to try, try to bid me a hundred thousand? This shit, I'm like, bro. Look, bro, I'm just bluffing. I just, I just love talking shit, bro. I ain't, gonna, I ain't no fast driver, bro. You're, you know, youngster. The thing I realized being at this, you know what? It's so many down. Interviewing these niggas for a couple yeah. years. So many niggas that are down to earth that I didn't think. Is it surprising you when you meet people like Big Sean, Drake? Yeah, yeah. How down to earth these niggas yeah. who are so called the guys that yeah. we we supposed to think uppity? I mean, I never thought that. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. I think God uppity. You mm. know what I'm saying? Absolutely. But, but like I, uh, it, it amazed me because like coming up in Memphis, like it's hard to get love and shit. Yeah. And so, but I, but I can't say for me because when I first came out, like they showed me love from the jump. So me, I got I actually I'm actually one of the, one of the first artists that actually made it in Memphis. That's a like fact. I actually got rich inside of me. I had to, I had to leave and go to Atlanta or nowhere else. So I, I love my city for like what they what they done and what they helped me with. But like it's it's amazing because you like you'll think like the people you meet that then on my level they be on some old cock ass shit. Yeah. And, we, and and for me to meet the guys like this way to the top and they have, and, and like Travis Scott and Drake and they show me the most love about everybody. Like it mean it, it made me look at look at this shit a whole nother way. If you're looking to book me for an interview video or by phone, if you're looking to have your music or your skill featured on my daily podcast, if you're looking to book me for a speaking engagement to help motivate some kids, if you're looking to have me rock some of your clothing to help promote your brand, make sure you hit me up at booking at Again, that's booking at